Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going over Q3 of the bi-weekly contest 51, maximum element of after decreasing and rearranging. So hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord, let me know what you think about this part, you know, now or during the contest. So, yeah, so the, the thing that I noticed about, there are a couple of observations to make about this problem. Um, the, the first one is that you can rearrange the number in the array in any order. And that for this array, you know, adjacent elements has to, you know, the difference has to be you go less than or you go to one. So combining those two, um, combining those two, uh, we basically have a greedy solution where we sort the array. Um, if we sort the array, then the smallest element will be one. And then we just basically go up the mountain as far as we can. And that's basically the idea here because, um, yeah, because that, because when we sort it that way, then, um, you can only go that way anyway. So that's basically my solution. Uh, I sort the way, I set the first element to one, and then for next one, I, I basically made it so that, it is either, you know, the minimum of either itself, meaning it's smaller, or the last element plus one, because that's the most um, incrementing that you can do from the last element. And then at the very end, I return the, the last element, which is going to be the max element, because we we, we we rearrange it, because I think they they try to throw you an example where, you know, you can go back to one, but if you really think about it, it doesn't really make sense, um, because you always want the biggest number at the end. Um so what is the complexity? Well, it's going to be dominated by the sorting, so it's going to be n log n. Um, yeah, uh, that's all I have for this problem. And to be honest, you may have you may wonder why or how I can prove this greedy. Um, I I don't really have a great answer for you uh, for the people at home uh, during the contest, and you can watch me solve it live during the contest afterwards. But but I think some of it is just about doing enough problems. When you, when you do enough problems, greedy properties of greedy you can uh, you can guess a little bit better and make educated guesses and that's the way that I did it here because after I sort it um, then this way a uh, you know because another way, way of phrasing this is that you know they because we always want to make the max number we always want to increase by one or you know stay the same if you're may equal to so it doesn't make sense to decrease and here it just means that you can change the number to the lower number of whatever you like um so that so all those things together uh allow me to kind of produce this solution um i don't really have a better answer than that or proof than that per se but uh but yeah uh watch me solve it live in the contest next
Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's farm and contest and so forth and whatever. Uh, I will see y'all later. Bye-bye. Mm, Take care of yourself. Stay good, stay healthy, and to good mental health. Bye-bye.